Here's a tech tip. You know, I'm constantly forgetting that there's new fishermen watching who are just getting into fishing. And I really, I don't cover the basics because I completely forget about there's people who are just getting started in fishing. So here's a little tip for you that I do every time before I go fishing. I check my fluorocarbon leader for nicks. You do a lot of fishing in the rocks, you're gonna nick your line up. So an easy way to check if you need to replace it is just run your fingers down it. If you feel any abrasions, if you feel nicks, you should probably replace it. I felt a couple, so we're going to replace this leader. This is a 12 pound Berkeley fluorocarbon. Oh, shoot. And you know what? This leader right here, don't just throw that away. Cut that up in about four inch pieces. Because we don't want it getting tangled up in some animal's feet. Cut that up in four or five inch pieces and the birds will pick it up and use it for their nest. Now that's conservation. Okay, nothing's getting tangled in that and I'll zip that up with the top hanging out like that so I can just grab it from my pack pull out what I need here boom and then and you'll even even double check your new leader because I've had brand new line that I felt nicks in and uh, I wouldn't use it. So there's a little tip from Uncle Jeff for you. Ain't a soul down here on either side. What in the world is wrong with people? We got a cold front coming in tonight. Cold front. It's supposed to snow tomorrow. First snow of the year. Well, it ain't the first snow of the year. How you doing? I'm Uncle Jeff. But yeah, we got snow coming tomorrow, and it's it's pretty cold out right now. I might have to put another sweatshirt on. But I'm tired of chasing deer already. I wanted to get another, I wanted to get a couple more dough. Hope you enjoyed my buck episode. That really turned out good for me. I was pleasantly pleased with that video and all the meat I butchered off of him. So I'm tired of chasing whitetails. It's firearm season and I should be in the woods, but I want to go fishing. I got some huge shiners. The bait shop finally got some big shiners. And it's it's probably not, not even what I need. I probably need small minnows. I, all my years fishing, I still ain't quite figured out when the switch from giant fall baits to tiny winter baits. I usually switch at first ice. And then, I don't know if that's right, but... Uh, I got huge shiners today. Let's get it, man. I want to go fishing. Yeah, I got an s and on. The old Uncle Jeff Parson. It's my bar. Oh, okay. And I have a hook with a weight on the shank. And it's got one of them little screw-on deals. 
I got my uh, S and P screwed on there and just skin hooked right here. There is a, a very deep drop off out there. And uh, watch my line. You can see the line getting tight. It's falling down into that drop off. And I want it to go clear down there and hit the bottom. Just like that. I got me a head shaker out there on the SP. Oh boy. <laughs> it's a nice one. It's a walleye. It's a nice one. On the old S and P, baby. <laughs> well, Scoot's going to like that. Thank you, Lord. What a beauty. You're coming home with me, Fred Garvin, male prostitute. I don't know why I said that. That's a keeper, boy. On the old S and P. Look at that. You like that S and P, don't you? Cheek meat. I gotta check his length. I don't think he's a keeper. He's not a keeper. There he goes. He's good to go, man. What a beaut. I got a big one. I hope you can see. Oh, come on. It's a walleye. Yes, 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 yes. <clears throat> How in the world? How in the heck? He's not a keeper. Yeah, if you look out there, you can see all them bait men is hitting the surface. I casted the SP right into that bait. <laughs> and boy, he hit it. He hit it hard. I'm gonna do it again. I, you probably can't see it, but there's bait fish. They're just going crazy right there. That's where the that's where the fish are gonna be. If you like this video, tap the subscribe. Ring the bell for notifications. Give me a like. Tell me where you're from. 
I was looking at my analytics, analytics, analytics. I have a lot of viewers from India. If you're from India, Majama, leave me a comment, man. I'm gonna see you next time. Peace.